Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am gonna do my February favorites. I am so excited to show you guys what I've been really digging for the past month. And yeah, let's get to it. But first, please subscribe to my channel if you're digging me so far. There's gonna be tons of new videos coming soon and please join the family. Thank you, thank you. So yeah, let's get to it. All right, so I am gonna start with my favorite skincare products for this month. I am really religiously, even though they said to use like once or twice weekly, I'm using it almost every other day because I love it so much. This is the Olay Herrickson Walnut Complexion Scrub. It smells amazing. It seriously smells like Chanel number no. five mixed with fruit. It smells awesome. Like, uh, die for this. Can they make this in a perfume? I will freaking buy it. And yeah, it is a facial scrub and it works on all skin types. And I just use this at the end of the day to give it an extra, you know, scrub a dub to get rid of all the grease, the oil, the makeup. Get away. So yeah, I really love this. And I really recommend Olay Harrison's products to everyone. Like, I've been using it, I've been using almost all of their products on my face and I absolutely love it. And my mom is a huge fan too. So yeah, if you have really troubled skin, go to Olay Harrison and give it a go. All right, and then the next thing that I am really digging this month, it is the Carbonated Bubble Clay Mask. Um, I've been using it almost every other day as well because I've been feeling like my skin has been so greasy and oily and weird at the end of the day so I really want to get all the impurities out so I did make a video on this please do check it out and yeah it's only $10 so I'm gonna use it as much as I want because it does not break my bank so I'm super duper happy with this and then this I got from Sephora. It is a reward, Beauty Insider reward, kind of like reward. Um, and it costs 500 beauty points. It's quite a bit, it's quite a lot. That means you spent $500 and you get this for free. But I really love it. And I've been using the pink one, which is the vitamin A. Um, Serum and it helps with my dark eye circles. It really does. The blue one is Cor Corella Serum and it helps with pigmentation, freckles, and dullness. Oh wait, actually the purple one is the Corella. And then the blue one is the Hydroloric, Hyaluronic, I don't know how to pronounce. I'm just gonna write it down. Hydroloric Acid, which helps with dehydrated or dry skin. So yeah, I really, love these I've been using this almost every other day since I've got it too so I'm really happy with it uh, what I am like seriously addicted to Birchbox now because I really found two great products but Birchbox and I Ipsy I think this one was in Ipsy I don't know but it this one is the Mena Beauty Sim Sim Mena Kada Beauty Simplified Lip Lock gloss stain in rosette and yeah I'm wearing it on my lips right now I'm mixing it with the Jeffree Star celebrity skin and I really love how you know it glides really well on my lips and I love it and then this one is the beauty protector protect and detangled leave-in conditioner I swear I think I got this like two weeks ago and it's empty I've been using it almost every day so if you have really bad tangled hair like me you go get this like I swear it works it's awesome and it really helps with like da damaged hair as well so and it smells great like you don't even have to wear perfume because it smells super good so yeah and you can buy the full bottle in birchbox.com as well all right, and so another thing that I got from Sephora, um, I asked them, I, I just love their value sets. I think they're just awesome because you really get 
a good amount of products in there for a really good deal. So they, they showed me a whole bunch of their value sets and I picked this one because I really need it for my damaged hair. My wedding is in August and I want my hair to look bomb. Like I really do. So I decided to go for this. It's only $25 and the retail value is $85. And I really have been using the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Nightcap Overnight Perfector. That is seriously one of my February favorites too because like overnight it does some sprinkle fairy dust magic on my hair and I wake up with good hair. So yeah, but I haven't opened this yet but open it with me. I mean, I already know that I, I would love it because there's just so much goodness in it. So yeah, let me, if I could just open it. Okay, I can't really turn, okay, there we go. So yeah, I think for $25 for all of these products in here is so worth it. So this one is Rita Hazan Weekly Red Rem Remedy Treatment. So you get two of the packets, which is great for traveling. All right, and then this one is Christophe Robin Mass Regenerant. Fucking hell. Um, regenerating mass with rare prickly pear seed oil. Mmm, okay. I love this. And then this is the Kwai. Hair care oh hoi. <laughs> Someone teach me how to read all these things. This is the Kwai hair care um, treatment mask. Okay. This is the Brio Geo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. Seriously, my hair is gonna look bomb by August with all of these. Um and then this is Verb Manage and Restore Hydrating Mask. Seriously, so many products in this thing. I'm so happy I got this. And then this one is Coco de Soleil. That I know how to pronounce, I think. High Gloss Mask. Wow, there's just so many. And then this one, okay, this one, if you have damaged hair, go get this, okay? I seriously absolutely love this. This is the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Nightcap Overnight Perfector. And then this is... Oh, what's with all of these products with such weird pronouncing names? Uh, Pyto Paris um, Exceptional Mask for Ultra Damaged Brittle and Dry Hair. Okay, I definitely need this. That's totally me damaged brittle and dry hair okay and then this is a BB hairdresser's invisible oil bomb to oil pre shampoo mask for dry to very dry hair I need all of them so yeah so these are like my beauty favorites I am super duper happy that I got this box set because it's just as you see there was just so many good products in there to try so I love it I'm done with our beauty segment um, another the two things I want to talk about really about my February favorites my favorite finds um, is so what happened during Valentine's Day I made reservations at Church Key that is one of my favorite restaurants in Sunset Boulevard um, in West Hollywood and you know I really effed up that night because I thought I scored with Guilt City um, $85 for dinner for two but because it was Valentine's Day we roll up there an hour in traffic after an hour in traffic we rolled up there and they said oh no you we can't do the Guilt City thing today it is prefix dinner for $85 per person and I'm like Psh! Okay, no, no, um, I am not going to spend $85 per person on food, like, no. So, you know, both of us were like, you know what, we'll bounce out. So we went to go next door and we 
stumbled upon this place called Takoya. And they seriously guys have like the best guacamole plantain chips there. Like I crave for it. I seriously eat there like once a week now. I really love it. So if you are in the LA area, go check that place out. Yeah. All right, and then um, the last thing I'm gonna talk about, but my February favorite is, so Mech and I, we, we go to the movies almost every week. So I decided to, you know, do at least one movie review on the movie that I think was the best out of the whole lot. And I feel like this month, my favorite movie has gotta be John Wick, okay? If you haven't watched John Wick, go. Go to the movies right now and thank me later because it is an awesome movie i am really into thriller into action into crime movies act, uh, and i said action again action so and hot hot male leads like keanu reeves so yeah that guy just don't age he is like i wonder if he does botox like geez but anyway, he still looks the same. But anyway, I love the movie. It was it was a nail biter. It was like my heart was racing like boom, 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 throughout the whole movie. And I just love the dog in there too. It's just so cute. And yeah, I really love the whole movie. Common was great in it. I don't really want to spoil too much for you guys, but it was a roller coaster of a ride. And if you haven't watched John Wick 1, it's okay, you know, it's not really, yeah, it's not really connected in a way. You could totally just watch John Wick 2 and then watch John Wick 1 later if you like John Wick at all. So yeah, I really recommend going to see John Wick and yeah. Thank you guys for watching my video. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And please click on my face to subscribe to my channel and check out my video as well on my carbonated bubble clay mask. So yeah, thanks for watching and I hope that you guys have a lovely day. Bye!